Hi guys, how's it going? It's 8 in the morning here and Mjolnir Strike just dropped so I think I'm gonna try it out. I gave it a couple of test runs and I felt like I was doing fine. So yeah, 738 is not that high of a score to be honest. Uh, but I think that's the most I can do. Like these three, these four are plus ten. Uh, she doesn't have a high scoring setup. They do. Maybe I need to put on. No, oh, she's got chill attack. Yeah, they block. They're locked, so things should be fine. I was expecting to score a little bit higher, but yeah. Um, let's see. Oh, okay. There's actually units and not just randos. Uh, is there anybody I can hit twice to proc? Can I break this? No. Uh, well, let's just hit you. Okay, and now bonfire is active. Perfect. So I can bonfire every fight. Uh, maybe the alternative would be this. Maybe I should have done that, but I think we can re-roll without, without much trouble. So yeah, I'm gonna, if things go wrong, I'm just gonna do that. Uh, and let's put you here. Let's see what happens. I decided to build a Tarja for, um, for ether raids for what season is this? Uh, for uh, light season actually and yeah it looked oh crap how much resistance do you have oh and you've got triangle adapt of course so I'm gonna put you here and peony who's gonna attack you you who cares uh, do I want to put you in danger ah you've got dragon effectiveness okay so let's do this, and maybe I should have taken a turn to go with Lavinia. Oh well. He's kind of being stuck, so he's not doing anything. And I don't think I score any higher for, for actually getting kills, so who cares. Um, at 2, and from that point on I will be able to... Um, I will be able to to uh, start getting my AOE special. You don't have any movement stuff, so I think we're good. Uh, oh, you have tactics buff, but since you are this, I need to switch back to a horse. And let's do this, so we give you buffs from Peony's weapon. First time using Peony, so apologize if it's taking me a little bit longer to get accustomed to things uh, looks like I can do this and you're gonna thank everybody I don't I don't know if there's anything special I need to be worried worried about to be honest uh, what's your swap okay I wonder if you kill do you kill? Yes, you do. Okay. So let's switch you back, and you should be fine, I think. And let's just kill the fur, just in case. Uh, uh, oof, sorry. Had a little twitch. And I can do this. And do I need to switch you? I don't think so. Let's just do this. She dies, she dies. Okay, now there's randos. Uh, by doing this, I drop everybody's HP. To one. And now Peony can get over here. You can get over here, and you can get switched to this, and we should be fine. And you should be this, so the tactics buff activates. 
Is there anything else I'm supposed to be doing? Like, this seems just really easy. I, I don't see anything anything weird or difficult happening here. Um, I'm sorry if this isn't interesting, but this mode seems really easy. Uh, oh crap, I clicked out of the window and you... Well, let's do this and you, what do you need to do? I figured Gale Forces would be strong, but then it turns out um, that I can just use Special Spiral. Mm, I'm getting hiccups. Dead, 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 dead. And let's do this. I don't know if I'm scoring based on the amounts of units that I've got. I don't know how this works. I haven't really checked that much. Ah, oh, sucks. I can't actually reach. Uh, oh well, end turn. Stage clear. Okay, what do I get? I score 738. So, that's it? That was my highest score. Uh, I guess I could switch you to a... Uh, I've... I've actually pulled a uh, off focus pity breaker um, Hellbindy, so I have another copy of um, the Green Duel Infantry, which I could put on my Raven, uh, but I need to farm HM first, so yeah, I don't know, this doesn't seem really, really interesting. What's, I mean, that's it? 738 is not that high. Yeah, and what do I. I don't remember what I score based on. Oh, we'll see. We'll see. Oh, well, uh, whatever. Um, so, AR. 160 ether. Basically, I am unable to get my final fight, unfortunately. Uh, I can get a rematch and I think I will get this one let me check if our, if everyone has got everything I I'm kind of panicking I pulled a um, I've actually pulled a Caden I spent a bunch of orbs and I had to buy a few I've actually pulled two Cadens one for each season um, and I decided to go for this setup. I might switch. Uh, let's let's do fierce stance because Canagus has the problem that his attack is really low and he's not killing anybody. Uh, that's what I've noticed. And she's got Gale Force Brazen, whatever. Uh, aerobatics, you're good. You're good. Okay, we should be good to go. Let's see what he's got. Tier 24. Okay, this is interesting. Reminds me of that our uh, map that I faced a, a while back. So I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna smite here. Uh, they don't have hardy bearings. So uh, with uh, dragon effectiveness, I'm gonna snipe the Duma. And then I'm gonna dance and snipe this guy and uh, since here uh, I have a bottleneck uh, Rolf won't be able to reach my dancer so yeah another episode of the Matthew show and uh, since my ether is fucked I won't be able to like I uh, I won't be able to get bonus matches uh, really annoyed about it really really quite peeved uh, you have dragon boots, armor boots, you can only get up to here, you can only get up to here, so you can nobody can reach here. Uh, you Alright, oh you give armor effectiveness, so you gotta stay here. Let's check, yep. And yeah, I think I think this should be pretty straightforward. So you get out of the way. You get pushed here. 
you snipe the Duma, you dance, you snipe the Veronica, and I'm afraid I'm gonna kill all of them, but my ether is fucked, so nothing is gonna happen to me. Vantage, 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 and Vantage. So yeah, I lost, uh, I lost 20 ether, but I'm at 60. So that wouldn't have mattered. I would have been at 80 minus uh, 50, 30, plus uh, 10, 40. So I would have been out. So yeah, I won't be able to hit tier 27 this week. Sucks. I either have to face this Roderick, which I'm not looking forward to, or maybe this guy. Uh, let me check. Oh, right, I need to show you my defenses. So this one happened and I'm super pissed about it because I lost score and this plus one Roy tanked everything, okay? And the reason why he did is because these, this Alm has got rally defense and he wasted time instead of moving here and actually hitting him. Um, so I got rid of rally defense on him. Look at this garbage. Hits for zero, lightning rod only hits once, uh, and this doesn't do anything, and he wasted his movement. So yeah, and he's also got a tactics room, so really annoying. Tactics room is something that you cannot prepare for on offense, unless you run like a Duma, but then you would be running a Duma. And yeah, uh, this was this was garbage. I'm really pissed about this. But yeah, he. Uh, let me check once again about his investment level. I want to see that I'm not fighting like a whale undercover or anything like that. Uh, or maybe I could go fight that Broderick. So no merges, one merge. Uh, how many merges? One merge. So yeah. Uh, and then this was just a uh, this was just a bait. So this doesn't matter. And this guy has a few merges. So plus seven plus seven mega wow and yeah so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go for this guy uh, let me check again this guy's offense what it looks like uh, right he has the mer at plus one he has this at plus one he has naga and then a burst at plus ten What's gonna be easier? Um, let's go for uh, let's go for this one. Let's go for this one. Tier twenty one. Okay, so not shouldn't be too hard. And this is his only hardy bearing user, so I can trigger the trap, get out of the way, um, and then snipe this. I should be fine. So it's Matthew time once again. He doesn't have any initial effects now. And Duma has Vantage and DC, so that's good to know. And let's put you over here just in case. No, not the trap. Okay, so we're gonna have to do some repositioning around. No, you got swap. And I don't have that much room to maneuver with, but I don't have to get the ether pods, and yeah, so I shouldn't care too much. 
let's see if I can just do this okay but you have um, steady lands so I actually have to get both Okay, so let's wait on our turn. Oh crap, and he's gonna get healed. Nah, shit, I forgot about my healing tower. I completely forgot. Shit. So I can move you like this, do something like this I hope we'll be fine, I don't know I'm not liking my chances uh, the trap being on the right and my healing tower really messed with me no, yeah, no, this is garbage uh, Let's let's look at the other guy. I always have trouble against Roderick. No more uses on the ladder and let's rematch you. Tier 25, bunch of dragons. Uh, and no hardy bearing user. So I think I want to trigger the trap. Snipe the Ephraim, have dragon effectiveness. Ooh, okay. Is this the trap? Yes, it is. Okay. We can do this. And I could actually just do something like this. I should be fine. Because you don't have anything weird and there's debuffs everywhere. Yeah, let's just do we put you closed? Yeah, let's put you closer. And yeah, this should be fine. Okay. So. Hmm. Crap. Okay. All right, because of this. Um. Oh, and there's a panic manner which I don't like. I'm gonna snipe it. Oh man, tactics room. I hate you. I don't need to do this, you can move over here. But yeah, let's do this and this and you should be debuffed so I should be fine. Yeah. Okay, so not year twenty seven. Uh it would have been a perfect offense. We would have hit tier 27 without the defense loss, but we still have to be rematched for today. So, yeah. Uh, that was day 3, day 4 fight. I actually ended up calcing it because I'm so pissed off about it. If I had uh, let the Makaya tank the uh, Lian, she should have survived. And so I would have been able to get the two pots. I won't. I only needed one, but you get my point. 
really annoying no perfect offense so almost perfect offense it would have been a perfect offense <laughs> I would have still had to play one match and yeah fuck my life uh, so let me show you my teams for the other week oh wow that's a long video uh, we're already 20 minutes in um, uh, let's go from the team builder so I can put my seals on as well so uh, this was Astra so we had these guys uh, Hector can't deal with Trace here and I have actually figured out that what deals with the threats that I'm having trouble with so what deals with uh, Thraceer, what deals with Sonia, Legendary Ohm, and Veronica Traps is, uh, don't laugh, <laughs> is a no follow-up Triangle Adept Sophia. And the problem is that I only can get my Sophia to plus four. Uh, so I need to get random Sophias in order for that issue to be fixed and in order to be able to tank uh, those lineups as well. It would also be helpful against a uh, random uh, freaking, uh, what was it, Roderick Lance uh, and stuff like that. Uh, the one thing that she doesn't, well, she doesn't actually deal with Roderick since she has double triangle effect, no, single triangle effect adept, but he's blue. Uh, but yeah, you get my point. Um, stuff that requires no counter to disrupt, uh, she would deal with. So, all star of the team, Matthew, plus nine, plus eight, he, I could get him to plus 10 plus 10, but he only needs the effect, the offensive stats. And uh, my Naga, who has a speed boon, uh, she has higher offensive stats with Fury. So she soaks chills off of him, both chill speed and chill attack. Really cool. Uh, Altina, love her. Uh, she's been great. Uh, Kaden, I haven't been able to try him yet. The next Asher season, we won't have the ability to run both these guys. Uh, but yeah, we'll see. Uh, Kanegis, I decided to switch to this. Uh, has I haven't been able to try him out with this success setup. Uh, he still isn't good enough against some of the stronger, um, what was it? Thrace here, weird combos, legendary on combos on my friends list. So yeah, um, there's this setup as well. Maybe instead of Rinya, I could be running uh, freaking Kaden. Uh, Kaden here. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Uh, yeah, panic, random. Uh, my let me show you my um so one thing uh, i switched out of the astra comp that i was running but oh crap uh, what was it uh, but um uh i actually partner veloria along with uh altina so here's the thing uh my veloria is minus speed so that's gonna be a problem. I haven't fully SI'd her because of the fact that with minus speed IVs uh, she might not be able to get tail forces off. So I've been wary of it. Um, but yeah, uh, I have Gale Force Fodder. I have two, um, two uh, Cordelia's ready. So her plus her uh, should be good enough to Gale Forcers and the cool thing is since she has Vantage she should be able to uh, get smited in Gale Force, uh, get danced, whatever um, and uh, she should be able to Vantage off the other uh, enemy units just like um, Legend Relief uh so yeah i'm gonna try this out for the next few weeks uh, i'll see if it works i need to get a lot of practice in um since he isn't being run since raven isn't being run on my trace here setup i might switch his blessing over to um over to either uh 
either uh, Astra so he can partner up with Valoria or to Light and partner him up with Valoria over there. There's uh, this YouTuber and Twitch streamers by the name of Atuljusin, I think that's how you pronounce it, but don't quote me on that, who does a lot of Gale Force and he's really good. I was talking to him just before starting to record and he does a lot of uh, Raven plus Valoria Gale Force. Um, so next week, uh, let's get the skill sets ready. Um, I don't think I want Ward Flyers anymore, but yeah, let's let's just keep it in, just in case. Uh, so her her legendary leaf. There are two options. There's either brazen attack defense or not S rank. What's this garbage? This is for the thing or quick impulse. Um, both are valid options, but since I'm gonna be running two dancers, who gives a shit if it takes one more turn to activate the first one? Um, Fjorm is gonna be the bonus units. My Fjorm is completely uninvested. I'll just stick a quick repost on her and be done with it. Uh, but yeah, she's fine. Bonus stats. Uh, Water season, she gets what she what's what do you get? Plus rest. Oh, plus rest. Wow, awesome. Uh, she gives speed. So basically, she is since I have 27 legendary heroes, you don't give anything, you only give HP, but that's 3 HP, 8 HP, and 5 rest, uh, 13 HP, and speed. Uh, 16 HP and 9 rest and 4 speed so yeah that's that's gonna make even an uninvested pure really powerful now Tharja I'm gonna be trying I'm gonna be trying she's not supposed to be running worse as she's supposed to be running fierce stance I need to finish farming the uh, SP for her in order to get glimmer on her as well which might be better. She's only at plus one for now, but I have the I have the fodder and the feathers here to get her to plus ten. Uh, I want to try out the arm trap on this air, uh, and yeah, I'm no longer gonna be running world flyers. I don't think. Yeah, let's just let's just run. Um, Sparkling boost, just in case. Or maybe not, or maybe I want like a pack smoke. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, I'm not gonna give you a a different C skill. I might give you Wings of Mercy. The problem is, uh, no, I actually have like four ca four canes. Yeah, a cane. Uh, so she gives. Oh. Wow, she gives uh, defense and resistance link, and she has smite. Fine. She doesn't. I'm not finished. <laughs> As you can see, I've only half worked things out. You have award flyers. Um, I'm gonna switch air. No. Uh, wait. You want this arm trap? And this is more useful. You want the skill link, yes. And I will give you. Um, yeah, chill death is cool. Uh, but I will also give you, just in case, I will give you um, ward flyers. Oh, you don't have ward flyers. I need to give it to you. Okay. Uh, I will remember to give her word flyers. Oh crap, and I actually need to be running um, chill attack. So maybe you are going to get chill attack? Is it better than chill defense? This is a vantage setup and she's offensive. Uh, I'll, I'll decide later. I'm gonna be running this set. I don't think I'll be using her a lot, but there's an Aversa as well. 
uh, there's her, there's the usual Fjorm, um, the usual Lucina and Ike pair, uh, and there's you two. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna try double sparkling boost. I'll see how it serves me. And she, um, Corin, I'm. I swear I'm gonna try using her. I'm not conf I'm almost never confident enough in her, but I I want to try to use her. She's a plus eight. Come on, she should be able to tank stuff, especially with the legendary Azora giving her plus seven to everything. So she gets plus thirteen to everything with Savage Breath. She should be good. Come on. Uh, so that would be. 46 plus 6, 52, 52 res, plus 10, 62 res on a colorless unit. She should be fine. I don't know, I'll try her. Plus another, another, no, she gives speed, okay. But she should be fine, come on. And maybe this is better, uh, two airs are better than a peony for her. Uh, with him, he doesn't need an answer. Uh, the two units to make him tank here are best. Uh, I didn't end up pulling for more merges um, because I was saving my orbs for a for another uh, close counter, which I did pull. Um, so now I have uh, two close counter units. I give oh crap! I gave one to. Um, I gave one to uh, the Tharja from the uh, Black Friday, uh, from the Black Friday Tharja. Uh, so I have her, uh, who I'm still keeping because I'm afraid they're gonna be raising the HM cap, and also I have a Takumi, who I turned into a manual, um, and I think I should be good. Like, this is gonna be a stacked week anyways, so, uh, um, my, my confidence is pretty high. I have a bunch of orbs. I'm almost thinking of making a plus 10 Astrum to replace my adult Tiki. Uh, not because I think he's good, I think he's awful, but he has an insanely high B, uh, BST. He has 175 BST. And so uh, he would be raising my cap. So uh, maybe he would be better and he would be helping me uh, stay in tier 21 instead of being tier 20 and a half. But I still need to decide. I have a green duel flying and a green duel infantry, which I should give to somebody. Uh, I'll, I'll decide, I don't know just yet. Uh, sorry for rambling, but yeah, this was this was my week, and we also did the new Mjolnir mode. Uh, only only eight fights, and I'm gonna get another fight in today, another defense in today. Um, if I get a success, <laughs> I'm gonna be pissed, because if I had a perfect defense as well, I would have been tier 27. So yeah. Uh, next week, bonus hero is going to be Fjorm, uh, and then it's going to be Altina. I actually have a green, and I saw uh, another YouTuber, uh, the name is Banana Lounge. He used her, and it was really interesting the way that he used her as a really offensive tank without any merges. And his was minus attack, minus actually plus attack, minus speed. But she did seem really useful. Uh, he gave her lull attack speed, which is a really premium skill, which I could give her. I have a serious. Um, and she did seem really good. I don't have an archer built or ready. Uh, because for Flyer Ball, I feel that Brave Ike does enough. But yeah, that's an option. I will consider it. And... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know anything, man. Uh, I don't know anything. Ah, uh, let's. I don't know, man. Let's hope things go for the best. This week went the way it went. 
and thank you guys for watching thank you guys for sticking around uh, I will see you guys tomorrow with the next week bye bye